All right, ladies, scary time. I'm about to do my first training session. So yes, I have been a bit slack and putting it off and then guess it comes down to confidence and making sure I'm giving you the information that you need. So Sunday afternoon, I thought I'd sit down. This afternoon, I'd watched a um, presentation during the week on how to make big profits and it had some really, really, really interesting stuff in there. So I wanted to impart that knowledge to you for you guys to start to use this month. So one of the biggest things that came from it is how to create massive profits. Well, how do we do that? It's simple, repeat and referral business. What does that come down to? That comes down basically to our follow-ups to make sure that we are servicing our current clients because those are the clients we want to keep that we want them to come back to us for business and they're the ones that are going to refer us to other people so how do we do that you off you hear um, all the blacklist status leaders that are coming up are saying there's a two by two by two referral system so two weeks you know two days two weeks and two months because most products are usually out or they're walking, especially with our mascara that they're wanting to reorder what I'm going to suggest to you is find the system that works for you so if it's two days two weeks and two months or if it's a three by three or what system works for you because everybody's different the second thing is we need to diarize this so you need to set yourself up a little calendar um, I think an online calendar is the better way to go because we're all on our phones or our iPads or our computers and so it's going to flick up our reminders on what we need to do for that day. Uh, my task for you this month is to set yourself a daily task list. So set yourself a goal of where you want to be and I'd love for you to message me your goals for this month. What do you want to achieve out of April? Once we've got that established, let's then set down some daily tasks and some systems that we can get working so that you can achieve your goals because really this is this is about us achieving our goals as a team but it's about you guys achieving your goals I'm here to help you guys achieve your goals okay excellent righty the other thing that I learned in this seminar is if you want to reconnect with your um, customers so um, you've been you haven't really done that referral system or you know you've, you've left it a couple of months and you want to reconnect there is a um, an easy way to do that and that's by a survey now I'm actually going to send this out to you guys and my second task for the month for you guys is to complete the survey for me so it's a short and sweet survey it's personal and it's about them so it's not about you it's not about your business it's about them this will also um, help you to get to know them and build that relationship with them so um, some of the questions that you can you know ask and this first the first two questions should always be their name and their email that way you know when the emails come in that and the surveys start coming in you know who they are and who they're coming from so definitely the name and email is your first question the second question um, they're recommending and which I think is a fantastic idea is family um, get them to ask, and you know, ask them to tell them tell you about their family. You know, are they married? Do they have children? What's their children's birthdays? Um, what's their birthday? One of the things, and I suppose if you think of it from our point of view, is how chuffed would you be if one of the businesses that you go through sends you a happy birthday uh, message on your birthday? That says a lot about your customer service. So definitely get those so that way you can then diarize these things. And if it's and for me, if it's one of your customers, and I have one customer who's been with me for um, pretty much the entire time that I've been doing this, which is as a year. Um, and on her birthday, I because she is one of my biggest customers and she does do a lot of referrals for me. I'm actually going to send her a little gift um, for her birthday to say thank you for being my customer so it can be a sample or a mascara or something that's pretty easy so those are um, you know ways to be able to keep those customers and they, they then feel um, loved and they feel that yep okay they are thinking about us and that um, they're going to want to come back to you and they're going to want to refer people to you so that's the second question um, keep mix it up a bit you know third question um, in the seminar she said that what the lady recommended was